Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back. So, I know I've been summoning quite a lot recently, but uh, today we're actually here to summon a little bit more. Because I actually, I think it was it, all the combination of me farming golems, plus this like bingo event, plus uh, this uh, special event that actually gave me quite a lot of stuff. Plus I also finished the quest, um, the quest for, for, uh, for... Finishing Star Sanctuary, yes. So right now I'm on Sky Falls. I'm actually currently stuck on this quest, trying to capture a Shelly. Um, you know, I'm just really, really unlucky. Can't can't actually get one to spawn. I originally planned to um, basically finish up all my quests so I can summon like three legendary eggs, but it's all right. We'll save that for next time. I mean, I'll have more eggs to summon by next time. But today we're going to be doing a lot of summons, a lot of rebirths, and I have two legendary eggs here to summon. So uh, let's get started. So actually before I start, I'm going to try to summon this Yuki and hopefully if I'm lucky I can get her as a variant. The Yukis are actually pretty good because they have a crit damage um, variant. Although my fire one is already a variant, I could build another one into a variant in the future. Alright, it didn't come out as a variant but it's, it's perfectly fine. Um, it's another food for my fire Yuki to get to evil 3. So without further ado, let's, uh, let's begin popping some eggs. See if I can get anything good. Alright, monkey. That's exactly what I need to feed to fusion. Oh nice, I got a Medusa. Medusas, um, I'm collecting Medusas to try to get my Dark Medusa to evil 3. So that's definitely really, really good. You know, I really want Julys. Because, uh, Woodbeth is good because he's also for fusion. Um, I can fuse him and make him into a, uh, I think it's Water Pokemon or the, the Siren. I can't remember which one fuses into which. But it's basically for my Victoria fusion, you know? Alright, this is Rebirth food. I just need like four more Julys and I can I can give my July to Evil 3. Alright, nice. This is a Water Coco, so I basically I, it saves me like one fusion. I don't have to fuse the other thing in, in, actually into the Coco. Saves me a bit of money and saves me a bit of time like trying to capture monsters. Alright, I got a Leo. Uh, it's another Leo. I've, I already have a few Leos. Definitely uh, need to save them up. Eventually, I'll probably build a Wood Leo to Evil Three. All right, it's Water Beth. He's for he's he's going to be for Fusion as well. Come on, give me some Julys. Fibian. Or not Fusion. Uh, Rebirth. I mean, from before. Alright, that's that's kind of rebirth food as well. Alright, I got a birdie. Um That's 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 rebirth food. This guy's also rebirth food. It's fine, I'm gonna be doing uh enough rebirth to get my guaranteed egg today. We're going all the way, alright? We're going all the damn way. Alright, not too lucky with the lightnings, but I'm actually like I don't really care that much because um, you know I'm just I'm just here trying to get that light sea star, you know. All right, sirens really good because siren I can use for for fusion as well. Um, I really do need sirens for. Oh, nice! I got another lightning, and it's a cupid. Fortunately, it's not. Uh, unfortunately, I mean, um, it's not a a uh, a a variant. See what I get from this. Oh, nice! I got a variant Yaksha. What's her variant skill? Ooh, she's got a forty percent crit damage. It's actually not bad. Um, I would say, I would say the best Yaksha is probably the Fire One because eighty percent attack down is definitely really, really high. Not a lot of monsters have attack down this high. Oh wait, I also forgot to tell you guys. I, I forgot to mention that um, it, you might have noticed my screen resolution is a little bit different. Um, I decided to just make the screen bigger. I think this is much, maybe easier for you guys to see. So, um, you know, hopefully you guys like it. I, I changed the resolution of my uh, emulator. So, um, yeah, this is definitely really nice. I, I've been getting a lot of variants lately. Like, I, I haven't been able to get variants before. I think I was just like, it was some, a part of some sort of curse. But now I'm actually able to get some variants. Alright, this is another Hana. Um, I can use the Hanas for, uh, 
um, eventually getting my Wood Hana to Evil 3. I think I'm pretty close because I already have my Wood Hana Evil 2. I, I got another Wood Hana from the event. Um, and and yeah, that's I think that's that's pretty much it. I, I was able to get uh, that and then I have like a few Hana saved up. So basically I need at least uh, 9 more. 8 more, 8 more Hanas and then I can get my Hana to Evil 3. I mean it's, it's eventual, alright? It's eventual. So, uh, the other thing I wanted to do is actually I just wanted to pop the truffles in the bond. Since I have some left over, I can use them as rebirth food. I might as well. So, you know, I might as well just pop them now. Um, not really for anything, just to basically get more food for, for rebirth. Because we're going hard, alright? I think my vari no variant curse is actually broken. Like, I'm actually starting to get variants. I'm, I'm starting to feel hopeful. Starting to feel like I can actually, you know, pull a variant Cupid at some point in the game. Yaksha is definitely not bad if I can get the fire one. Because the crit damage leader works everywhere. So I can actually put her on another... Because uh, attack down doesn't matter. I can actually put her on my nuker team, you know? And for for Titans and stuff. She's definitely going to be pretty good. If I can get a fire one. I actually don't have a fire one. But it's probably easier to get the fire Yaksha than it is to actually get a variant Yaksha. Alright, my inventory is full. So I might as well some, uh, do, some, do some rebirths right now. Now I've been using these truffles and bonds in a long, long time. Alright, you want to... You want to play hard to get, huh? You want to play hard to get. All right, all right. I can play. Don't worry. We're, we're, we're reaching. We're reaching the threshold very soon. We're about to go all the damn way. Get that rebirth. All right, just two more to go. Um... Alright, can't use my Medusas, can't use my Sirens. I can use these. Maybe I should save my Mihos. I guess I can get more Mihos in the future, it doesn't really matter. Um, I don't think I need Fibians, yes. this. We're definitely going to rebirth this away. Alright, alright. Oh, I actually got a Lightning! Okay, I got another Dark Sea Star. Let's see, let's, see, let's actually take a look at her, her slots. Uh, oh wait, it's right here. She has a square double, uh, double, double diamond. This is actually different from my current C star, who has a tri square double triangle. So I can definitely, um, you know, fit a different set on her. She's gonna be pretty good. I'm pretty, yeah. Having another dark C star is definitely really, really good. Um, the thing I'm actually aiming for is actually the light C star. If you, if you guys don't know yet. Oh shit! I can't use these bets. <laughs> I, I was, uh, that was a close one. All right, that was a really close one. I can use this Beth though, because he's he's the wrong color. Um, I don't need the Monas anymore because all my Monas are basically maxed out. So, all right, here we go. This is the uh, after this one's going to give me a guaranteed uh, summon. Hopefully, I get what I need. All right, what's it going to be? Oh, it's another Dark Sea Star. Hmm. This one also has a square. Alright, so I'm fortunate that I wasn't able to get the Light Sea Star. Um, but I guess we can keep going. I mean, there's 12 days left. I'm pretty sure I can get to another 30. You know? So I might as well rebirth everything I don't need right now. Um, and also, you know, before I actually do that, I should actually put everything I do need into storage. Um, so I don't, I don't, make, I don't make any mistakes, alright? I don't think I have two more or too many more monsters to actually use for rebirth anymore. Um, yeah, I'm kind of kind of running out. So I guess I guess that's pretty much it for today. I mean, I did get two more dark sea stars, which is which like they're really good monsters. So um, you know, definitely definitely do something with them. Like it's definitely possible to do something with them for the future. Um, Alright, let's feed whatever random three stars I don't need away right now. And I guess that's a wrap. Alright, I, I know what exactly what I need. I summon this last one. 
and this is going to just be my last fusion. I mean, I'm probably not going to get a lightning on this one, but if I do, you know, it'll be it'll be pretty sweet. Pretty damn sweet. All right, that's the Bond, that's the Phibian, and what was the last thing I was going to use? Oh yeah, it's this monkey, this extra monkey that I don't need. All right, it's just another monkey, but it's fine. We're getting closer and closer to 30. Man, I have three dark sea stars now. What am I gonna, what am I gonna do with them? I have so many dark sea stars and mihos. It's it's pretty crazy. I have three dark mihos, three dark sea stars. All of them have square slots too. I mean, I can definitely uh, do something with them for the future. But um, you know, I'm gonna keep trying. I'm gonna go for another 30, and then you know, if I'm lucky enough, I'll be able to um, finally pull my light sea star. So, yeah, that's pretty much it for the summoning part of this video. Um, actually, you know, didn't want to just make a summoning video because I have ba basically just been making summoning videos for the last few days. I also wanted to give you guys an update about, um, you know, what I'm actually doing um, in the game right now. I managed to, well, actually, I didn't manage. I basically, I just got my Dark Mona, uh, both of them maxed out, got both of them gemmed up, got both of them to Evo 3. This one's pretty, this one's good. This one's really shitty. Um... But it's kind of the only gems I can afford to put on her right now. So, you know, it is what it is. But uh, they're actually doing a really, really good job farming. Like if you, um, I guess we'll go into, we'll go into this map, you know, because I was farming some Shellies right here. And they actually do pretty well. Like if you, if I just, I'm also leveling this, um, this Tiger because, well, because I have nothing else to level really, like I, I really just don't have anything else to raise. So I decided to just raise this tiger because I can, I have a few tigers laying around. And um, in this fusion, like the not, in this event, I mean, I can fuse an evil two tiger, so I can ba basically make my dark tiger evil two plus one, uh, just like right now, basically. So I, I can probably make him, you know, kind of strong. So. Um, I was thinking why not 6 star him and just basically have another another pretty good monster to play with. He is a tank type, he's a dark tank type who has a uh, morale boost on first skill and attack down on AoE on second skill. I think he'll be, I mean since he has attack down he should be pretty okay for like titans and stuff. Not really going to use him for anything else. Basically just leveling some monsters so they can um, have higher stats and I can just use them for, for titans and stuff. So that's pretty good. Um, yeah, as you can see, I think this team is farming pretty well. I mean, they, I don't have siphoning on them. You know, it's kind of it's kind of hard to get a good, uh, really good siphoning set. But um, I think it's already pretty good. I mean, both of those monsters have morale boost. I if I have a siphoning set, I don't really even need to use morale boost monsters. I can even use something that that's like completely, um, totally different. Wait, why don't I have Auto battle times 21. Did I c catch something? But anyways, I I'm I'll I'll just show like one more run. Um, we can do some guild battles, and I think that that'll be it. I can't really do like there's no real real point doing arena today because it is really really early in the week, um, and my ranking is like really low. So basically, I'm just fighting people with like you know random. Uh, one monster defenses and stuff, so it's it's not really you know anything anything worth watching. Um, but yeah, I just I wanted to give you guys an update on on everything else um, besides just summoning. You know, I I really really encourage people to make an actual farming team. Like it's really really good. You don't you probably just need um, if you if you don't have Dark Mona. What you could use is actually like Water Mona because she also has Morale Boost and she's Water and you can just go to maps that have like mostly fire. Like literally like this map has like all fire. So if I had like two Water Monas it would actually be more effective on this map. But the good thing about the Dark Monas is since they're dark um, and they do a lot of damage, they're basically effective on you know every single map in the game. So I can basically just use this team to farm literally everything. Um, <laughs> I kind of wanted to show you, show it off. You know, it, it's it's pretty good. Um, another oh shit, fuck! I forgot to turn off the turn off the auto battle. I wanted to show you guys um, me using the two my two dark monas in in uh, Starstone as well. 
and the element dungeon, whatever element it is, I could probably nuke it, you know, so it's, it's probably not going to be too hard. Um, hey, maybe I should 6-star my Tiger in this video, so I don't have to do it in the next. I can just keep farming, and then get him to max level, you know? I think that would be a pretty good idea. I'll, I'll uh... After this run, I'll go out, I'll feed some fruit stone, and I think we have enough star stones to make them six stars. If not, I think I'm really, really close. Like, I can just basically show off my dark monos and stuff, doing some star stone, and then, uh, and then my, my tiger can be six star. Alright, I did turn off the auto times 20, right? Good. Alright, I might be missing... Oh, wait, 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 I forgot, I forgot. There's something I actually forgot to do. There are four eggs that I forgot to summon. And they are right here. Hmm, I might be able to do one more rebirth. Oh no, I can't, it's a C-star. can't rebirth this. Can't rebirth C-stars, you know? I'll probably keep going till I reach another 30, and then I'll stop. Like, if I don't get my light C star before then, um, some things aren't just, are just not meant to be, alright? Really, really shouldn't force it. Oh, nice! It's a wood one. It's perfect. I don't have to use her for fusion. Uh... Yes, okay, so, wait, I just realized something. I can't even 6-star him because I don't have enough gold. Alright, I guess we won't be 6-starring him in this video. Um, but I do want to show, like, a run of them, like, doing star stones because they can basically nuke through the whole thing. Like, I can literally use this team. I've been using this team to, like, do some star stone test runs. It's actually pretty good. Um, might as well refill because I'm going to be doing clan battles as well later. Oh yeah, I also forgot to tell you guys, I actually, uh, I'm actually, like, putting my mic slanted. Um, I made this, like, ghetto mic, uh, sponge, like, it's, this is, like, one of those, like, um, da dampening sponge thingies that, like, make the mic not, um, pick up sound from other directions. Or, like, it, it dampens sound, basically. And then you know how people make those, like, boxes, um, around their, their mic? I can't really do that because I need to, like, show my face while I'm recording on face cam. So I basically I wrapped the, the sponge around my mic, like, only behind it. And then I also got a new, um, I bought a new pop filter and it basically just got delivered yesterday. So, you know, I, I think I have even higher, like, sound quality than before. Um, and hopefully you guys like it. Like, hopefully you guys like the, the improvement to the, to the sound quality and stuff. Um, this is actually a little bit dangerous. Alright, okay. Let me just, uh, put my mic there. So, you guys might have been distracted a little bit. But as you can see, I don't actually need a healer or anything for, um, for the Starstone run. And they can basically nuke through the whole thing pretty fast. Because they are just very, very strong attackers. Alright. Oh, wait, why did I turn off auto? Oh shit, I'm gonna like not forget to turn on auto when I come in next time. Oh nice, I got another egg. Wait, do, do you guys know what that means? Is it is it like, is this the egg of destiny? I think it actually might literally be the egg of destiny. Should I buy these fire leo stones? I'm kinda broke. Probably buy them later once I farm some gold. Wait, I think it might be the egg of destiny. Do you guys believe in the egg of destiny? Is it gonna be? All right, it's it's nothing, but it's it's basically it's gonna be the perfect material that I can use for rebirth, and then you know what's gonna happen. Do you guys know what's gonna happen? Wait, I can use that siren. What am I gonna use? I can use this Vivian. 
I don't need the Fibian. I don't need the shell either. Alright. So, this. This is. This is the, uh. This is the rebirth of Destiny. Oh, uh, nope. It didn't, it didn't, it didn't happen. Alright. <laughs> Would have been pretty cool if it did, though. Um. You know, you got, you got to admit. Anyways, uh, let's do our clan battles. I might as well buy these now so I don't forget them later. Should I work on a Fire Leo? I think Fire Leo is pretty good. Do I have any stones for Fire Leo? Am I collecting him already? I have 10 already. I might as well keep going, you know? Alright, let's, let's do some clan battles. No members currently in battle. Perfect. Now, should I should I seriously clan battle? Should I should I make a new team? All right, let's. You know what? Let's let's make it. Let's make a brand new fire team. Like like let's let's just like make an actual, real, legit team. You know, for clan battles. So first team, I'm gonna use um, a bunch of water sustain monsters. Basically, the sap team. Um, Why? Because actually, no. I should mix it up. I should put my water lat in here, and then not use the Hana. Go like this instead, and then I can use that Hana on another team. Basically, like a mostly water team. I can put this, put in my Hana. You know, resist leaders. Really, really sweet. Um, it's Valk. Wait, actually, I have no water monsters. <laughs> Probably shouldn't just be throwing in random monsters. I might as well be throwing all my water monsters here. They're gonna be living the longest. Actually, wait, no, my Valk Val Val doesn't have any gems. I guess I should put in my aggressors. Um, I'm gonna be careful though. I don't want to waste my aggressors. Oh, this guy's got attack down. He's pretty good. Actually, wait, no, I should. Hmm. Should I stack two healers? Maybe Kuro would do pretty well. We're just here to basically sat for days and just, you know, live forever, basically. Um, you know what? You know what? I don't think Lat that... I, I think we need to switch them around. If I, if I want this to be perfect, I need to switch them around. And I also need to use uh, Water Miho on the first team. For her resist lead. Use this lot. Use uh I think that's it. That's really all I can uh all I can hope to use. Um what was the other water monster I want to use? Or at least some self-sustaining monster, you know? I, I could probably put in some, like, my Monas. I don't really need them for a light team. I have some better monsters I can put on a full light team if I want to do that. Alright, so for my second team, I'll go with, uh, you know, water defense lead. Like this, and then I'll sustain like crazy. And then for this team, I'm going to put in some, like, some, like, crazy, crazy nukes. I'm going to, I'm going to fuck them so hard, alright? We're going to use, um, obviously we need armor break. Yes, we're going to stack the shit out of armor break. We need defense down as well. We also need, uh, what other, what are other really strong devos can I throw in here? Alright, fuck it. She's probably going to die in one turn, but, you know, as long as she can land the defense down on first turn, she's good. Alright, as for the second team, this is going to be just basically like all the nukes to, that you can possibly, I can possibly throw in. Right, wrong Mona. This, this Mona is the right one, right? Because I can use the Mona leader skill twice because I have two dark Monas. Alright, this one's the good one. Alright, alright, this is going to be, it's going to be sick. All right, let's do this. Let's fuck him up. I 
I hope this works. I was basically out for the whole day yesterday, so I um, I kind of skipped my clan battles. That's why I'm a little bit on the... I'm basically last place in my clan right now. But that's all about to change. Oh shit, I remember what I was going to use. I was going to use the Water Cure on my first team. Well, this is not too bad, actually. It's basically me just sustaining forever and sapping like crazy. Well, until I get stunned. And, yeah. Alright, we got more saps than he can handle. Come on. Oh man, I want I wanted that lad to get that armor break down one last time before he died. So I could get armor break for another turn. Looks like that ain't happening. Sorry, my Miho's still got like one more nuke. Oh no. No. No luck with the saps. It's unfortunate. probably put like a my fire Persephone on my first team it's gonna be like the sap comp the ultimate sap comp it's actually doing quite a lot of damage because all these sappers are are water damn he got a full turn he got a full team stun just now it's really bad don't you wish you can just seal the boss That'd be pretty damn sweet. Oh shit, my Hana's done. Well, it was good knowing you all. Oh wait, 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 no, 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 she's got one more turn of heal. Alright, I think I can keep this up for quite a long time. It's just my Siren was too squishy. Damn, that Siren. Come on, I just need Hana to live one more turn, and she can get another heal up. Alright, here we go, here we go. Okay, I, I don't, I, I honestly don't think my Yuki can take much more. Yeah, she's dead, but the other two are still gonna keep going. Oh no, my Hana actually died. Alright, he's starting to do too much damage. Blessing's getting a little bit ridiculous. Alright, come on, last some armor breaks. Alright, here we go, baby. Here comes the f here comes the damage. <laughs> Holy shit. That was so much damage in one turn. That that my my bar wasn't even full yet. Alright, alright. Time for time for my Indra to use his active. Alright, might actually kill this boss. Just I just need to like survive this turn somehow. Yes! Well, he did get Thirst on um, some of my units, but it's fine. My Cupid doesn't have Thirst, and he has a shield up. Ooh, alright, I think I, I think I got this. I think he, they might be able to survive this. They might. I just need like my Indra to survive or something. Yeah, that's perfect. Alright, I actually managed to kill him. That was, uh, that was not bad. Dang, man, they, they messed up my, uh, my plans, you know? They, they messed up my plans for, uh, to make a, like, a three fire comp. I could make it here, actually. I could just make the team here, and then use it for this light boss. I still have a bunch of dark monsters. Alright, so, uh, I'm going to. I'm gonna put some shitty monsters on the first team. Still gonna try my best to, uh, use whatever I can. You know? Um. Should probably save the good armor break for later. 
This will put Snowy. Actually, we know he has good attack down. We'll put this John, this July, this, this, this Scrub, this one as well. They have no leader skill. Guess I'll use my Yuki instead. I'll throw this one away. Uh, she could probably use my Medusa, but he, she's actually a bit under leveled. This guy's got a bit of attack. Cure is a pretty good healer. Actually, I should just I should just throw in my Nightmare. She's 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 not that good. Okay, so this is uh this is like the actual actual team. Now some decent light monsters. So this is my full light team. Can we also make a full dark team? I should at least put in one healer, to be honest. This should be pretty good. Alright, this should be a pretty good second team. I mean, I think I really gotta, like, one day just sit down, like, look at all my monsters and just, like, plan an actual clan battle team. But that's not gonna happen for a very long time, because I, I gotta get, like, a... Like, I, I need to make the perfect farming, just like, for farming purposes in general team. Um, and then I need, like, a perfect Dragon's B10 team first. I think that's probably more important. Gotta get those sick Dragon Gems. Ooh, shit. Alright, they're dead. Rip. Alright, he's got his uh his AoE. I think I'm dead. Alright, it's gonna do quite a bit of damage. Wait, my freaking uh my jelly the doesn't have crit, so she actually has no armor break. Well, this team isn't good. There's no armor break. I just realized. What the hell was I doing? Oh my god, I fucked up. I should have put like a armor break team here, and then put my dark team, and then I throw away, put two more throwaway teams on the top for later, and then I put in an armor break team, uh, on this side, and then I put in my light team for the last team on this side, and then it, it would have been perfect. I'm retarded. Oh god. Oh shit. Hmm. Oh shit, is it this 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 again? I don't think you can survive the Light Titan. The Light Titan actually does quite a lot of damage. Yeah, he can't even break her shield right now. It's gonna it's gonna take a while. Light Siren's insane, like, she is just crazy. She's absolutely crazy. You know, you know what would be perfect if, if I had her on a team? I just get Light Siren and three Light Victorias. And she can basically, like, perma sustain them. Well, not, not perma sustain them, but basically sustain them for, like, like, uh... I don't know, like 10 turns or something like that. Because look at this. She's still going. Alright, she's going to get a heal. Basically, almost get back to full. And if he doesn't break this, she won't die. If she, he breaks this, she's going to take some damage. But I think she's dead this turn, though. I don't think she survives this. Although she has another full bar. Yeah, now she's dead. All right, I kind of fucked that up. That was that was my bad. Oh, 
It wasn't all that bad, but it was it was pretty bad. Alright, since I fucked up my last team, I might as well just uh I might as well just fuck it. Alright, I, I I'm I'm too lazy to make a team. <laughs> I'm too tilted actually. I'm not too lazy. I'm too tilted. Like I I I fucked that team up and now I don't I don't feel like being serious anymore. I'm sorry. I'm just gonna throw in whatever I have left and uh We'll see how much damage I can do, and that's pretty much it. So, in conclusion, after you're done with uh, your golems team and stuff, um, since dragon's a little bit hard to work on, you should probably, like... Well, actually, you can make a nuker team just to, like, refill through dragons so you can at least farm it during the weekend. And then work on a farming team. I think a farming team is definitely really, really good. Because it just makes all your runs faster. Faster runs equals more farming. More farming equals faster progression. So, um, farming team is definitely really good. Just like a general purpose. Like, if you can't use like dark element, use like, pick one element where it's like, good. You can use it against most elements. Like, if you're using like a team of like, three water monas, it actually is not bad, because the water is neutral against Starstone 10, which is like dark, and then the boss is fire, so you can actually kill him pretty easy. And then you can use the water to farm the uh, the magma crags and the uh, sky fall something. What is it called? Skyfall ruins or something? Um, you know that that XP map is like three fire. It's like all fire, so you can use like a full water team against that as well um, but I think it's probably better if you have a, uh, a element neutral team like a dark team that would probably be perfect you know what would be the actual perfect farming team you need three evil three fire Siegfrieds all on siphoning you will farm like a boss They, they will literally one-shot everything. Like, they'll go first wave, and then they'll get their bars all charged up to full. And then they'll just be spamming their nukes non-stop. The whole entire, like, rest of the run. Might be a little bit overkill, but you never know, because they can... They're gonna add more maps in the future. So you're gonna need, like, stronger monsters to be able to, like, one-shot this. So I think, like, Fire Siegfried's gonna be really good. How close am I? I'm, I'm very close. I, I'm like 150 points away. Um, I never actually buy anything else. I'm just saving for that this this egg, you know. Hopefully I get the fire one. I think the fire one's definitely better. Um, but even if I get the other ones, I can use them for food for the fire one in the future to get into evil 3. Because he definitely does like need to be evil 3 if you want him to be like the best farmer possible. Um, yeah, he's, he's super good. Like... Alright, I think that's that's it. I don't think I have it really any more to do today. Um, I'm going to get back to farming. I'm going to try to complete my quest. And tomorrow I'll probably be able to summon my like last uh, legendary egg. And I'll probably be farming golems a bit to get more like eggs and stuff to summon for you guys. So, you know, definitely, um, definitely watch out for that as well. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.